<laughs> okay, before I hit record, Michael was like, I got friends. His name is Jenkins. I don't know who that is. He never will. But say hi to Jenkins, everybody. That's Mike's friend that he has. That bitch doesn't even exist. What are we playing, man? We can play whatever we want. We can play whatever we want. We're free. Isn't Orgasmo... We can do whatever we want. Isn't that want. a Kevin Smith movie? Hi. Uh, or is it a... Mike Judge movie, perhaps? I don't actually remember. I don't think it's Kevin Smith. I think I just made that up. South Park, dude. That's what it was. That's who it is. Yes. Matt Stone and Troy Parker. What are we taking, brah? Brah. Well, I think our options are Frost. Brah. Brah. Crass. This is pretty Michael, good. Michael, what are we taking here? Fire Confluence is a pretty good start. We could be mono red. Try it. Try to go for the mono red. I took it. I slammed it. We can do whatever we like. Grim Lava Mancer is a good dude. Oh, Treachery is a good dude, though. Treachery is pretty good. Y'all got any more of them treacheries? Yeah, I don't think we passed Treachery here. Grim Lava you? Mancer is not that impressive either. Like, you don't often have enough cards in the graveyard. Just There's not that many fetches. In around. the red deck? Yeah. Oh, my God. Fuck, guys. Guys, he... I would rather hedge... Uh, plus, the, the Lava Mancer is totally wheeling. Like, there's no way it's not. So, I'd rather hedge with the treachery. And look, now we get a Thunder Mile Hellkite. God, you're so bad at this I mean, game. I'm still fine with playing both those cards in our deck. It's too late. We can't. Why not? Because that's not how Magic the Gathering you works. Could, you could also slam the Immortal Suns here. That's too expensive, Moochel. Spellseeker gets our Fiery Confluence. No, it doesn't. Can you imagine if I got any instants in sorcery? That'd be busted. Oh, Rift Bolt. Rifty or B. Or Cloud Skate. Or Rifty B. No, it's like Cod Skate. Rifty Bif Biftle. Or Riffle McBiffle. Oh, Jano's here, and he loves he loves the red. Riffles McBiffles, right? I'd rather take Chat, can you let us know if it's Cloud Skate or Riffles? Which Rift, Rift is Riffle's it? Riffle's like the worst... Which rift is it? It's like the worst of this, the three mana damage spells. <sighs> Rifty B. Skate. I don't know what Riffles McBiffles is. <clears throat> so we got at least two red ones and one, uh, three red ones. Go red. That was, that doesn't count. That's the same. You can't, you can't, you can't vote twice. You red pick summon to me and I'll pick all the red. Rift Sing. Oh, here we go. Getting rewarded. Okay. Got him. God, he's such a sucker. He won a little baby. Got him. So now it's awkward. I don't really care about Devil's Play, but Devil's Play, I have lost to Devil's Play. Still a bad card, though. It puts you, you put it right in the graveyard, man. Just take priority and head to that blue. Got him. I got him. Take the I'm just going to take all the red cards, and they're not going to have any red cards. You ready? Dang. Take the... This actually could be good. Yeah, it could be. In case we're blue-red. This is Lil' Terry. You know Lil' Terry? I'm scary, Terry. Oh, that's not even him. It's over here. Dang it, I got the wrong... I was highlighting the wrong card and everything. You basically screwed up your entire existence. I know. God, I hate when you're right. And it never happens. Yeah, that's a weird thing. It never happens. His adaptability gets cheaper with instant sorceries in the graveyard scary terry yeah okay oh bitch <laughs> memory last is actually pretty good in a blue or a tumbo deck i agree it doesn't trigger a runway steamkin though which makes me real sad you're right oh fire, fire ice, ice comes back god That's a good one. was this the grim law answer pack i think it was i do believe so immortal sun came back sort of war and peace also came back which is actually it's a shit sword but in the mono red deck, it could be good. Just steal an extra, like, a million damage. I mean, that sword's kind of crap because of the protection colors are awkward. But, like, if it hits, it hits pretty hard. I know. That's what I said. God, it's like you don't even listen to me. Uh, I'd take the Gravecrawler. We could have done a red black, if possible. It was a drama. No, just not. And a hippie.
Okay, whatever, man. <laughs> I think this is actually pretty good so far. Of course, we did not get the Grim Lava Mancer that you said would come back, you lying. Okay, well, glad we're in blue. Hopefully this roast or this is a charm comes back, but uh, I'm good. You guys ever cast a Consecrated Sphinx before? You can do whatever you... I need to listen to this song just so I can get out of my head. Hmm. Negate. Hazaret. This does not strike me as a deck we're going to be Hazareting. Mm, no. I like Negate, though. Yeah, I think Negate's good. Murmuring Mystic seems great in this deck. Over Young Peasy. Oh, man. It makes, it makes floaty boys. What if this comes back? Hmm. I like that. I like this better just because it triggers Runaway Steamkin. Plus, Young Peasy's not going to come back. Right. Flipped through channels last night, and original Spy Kids was on with those creepy hand minions. Your little hand things remind me of. Remind me of them. I like the, like the period that your, your hand things remind me. Figure? Of them. Yeah, Young Peasy and Lil Boofy go way back. Hmm. Did you say figure? Mm -hmm. I don't like figure in, in, in non-white decks, you know though. Char. I don't hate Char. The X spell never, never works out. How dare you? Plus, it's totally going to table. Okay, that might be true. I don't think Char isn't going to table, though. Oh, oh, boy. Yeah, let's take that. Our six drops are, are lit, boy. Oh, lightning, lightning bolt? bolt? Yeah, yeah. Maybe the Vandal will be on. If the Vandal or the Sower come back, I'll be I'll be A-OK. -okay. I'm going to take this with Seagate Oracle. Seems good. This deck's looking solid. I'm not a big fan of Imperial Recruiter yet. It gets Paturgle. It does get Paturgle. <laughs> Paturgle. Buddy, let me tell you something about our Lord Keep and Savior. Keep your stupid knife. Okay. Oh, two very good swords. There's also Firebolt, though. I think we'd rather have that sword, though, right? I agree. This is how you remind but me it's that I have little colors. hands. Not like you to say <laughs> so. Yeah, so you can't put it on your own guys. Oh, wow, they both came back. I like, I think it's probably is a charm here, right? It's more versatile. Plus, you can loot with it. God, everybody loves a good loot. Loot them and shoot them. That's what I always say. Okay, I went a literal, but I went for a literal banana, and all of a sudden there was blue in my red. I thought that I thought the deck was red. I actually like the Rand Dynamo because we have Devil's Play it, and the if the expansion explosion comes back, it could be very, very good. Yeah, and Quad Blue's a little rough. Oh, Murmuring Mystic came back. Oh yes. Oh, that's all I wanted is the Young PZ Murmuring Mystic deck. We are doing it. I like Manas Mass Manips as a card a lot, but I think it is very hard to cast. And if you guys are watching on YouTube, or if you're watching on Twitch, watching on anywhere, check out MeUndies.com slash Frank You'll get 15% off, along with free shipping and free returns. You can find the link below in my description of the YouTube video or of the Twitch profile. And uh, they have super, super comfortable micromodal underwear and lounge pants, socks, tees, whatever you guys are looking for. You can find them at MeUndies.com slash Frank Lepore. Definitely check that out. Whatever. It's a 2-2 that loots. What I'm trying to say is the output seems a little quiet. Really? Is that true? Is anybody else having an output problem? Is the volume low for people? Is that a, is that a problem? Are you guys having a problem with low volume? It is a quieter stream? Oh, no. Hmm. I, I dislike. All right, I'm going raise to the, raise the gain again, I guess. 
Let me know if that's any better. I raised the gain for you guys. I don't know if that's going to help, but we shall see. Because I'm pretty sure I have my my speaker volume maxed out. Oh, it's your boy. Yeah, so you got a levels here. Yeah, my USB, my, my mic volume is maxed out. I'm going to take Jace the Mind Sculptor. Let's see what else is in the pack. Oh, basically nothing. Gotcha. No, Pestermite's good. Well, it's not. It doesn't matter. Oh, we got a Chain Lightning. Chain Lightning or a Click. Really? Because when I when I rewatch my own YouTube videos, I they, the volume seems fine. That's really weird. We can even take Zergo here to get closer to the ground. I think Zergo is garbage. I'd rather take Chain Lightning here. What about Click? No, let's just burn him. Oh, because we have Murmuring Mystic, Young Pyromancer, and Runaway Steam Can, I want to have more red things, red instants and sorceries. Control Magic. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Can we get a single? Oh, boy. I mean, we're red blue. It's pretty good. I would really like some fixing lands here, but I don't think they're happening. Probably not playing Petromander. Petromander? Petetramander. Petetramander? Maybe we are, actually. Why wouldn't we? Splinter Twin, take it. Oh, I'm taking it. This guy seems like it's going to be pretty hard to cast. Oh, Spire Bluff Canal. That's exactly what we wanted. Good pickup. Thank you. Come on, Steam Vents or Sulphur Falls. One time, one time, one time. Daddy, daddy, daddy needs it. Come on, bring it home, bring it home, bring it home. We got two packs left. Two packs, two packs. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Volcanic Island. I, I would also take a Volcanic Island, yes. Uh, I'm pretty sure you can't mod the packs in the new in the new Magic Online. I'm pretty sure that was a previous version. How many six drops? Compulsive seems Compulsive is much better. Well, this is going to go on the sideboard for now. Days? Mana War? I like Days a lot here. It triggers all our guys. It's a free counter spell. Yeah. I think I'd have played over Negate in the main. Oh, well, there you That's go. That's nice. I guess... Splinter Twins coming back in. Good lord. Now we have three cuts to make. Yikes. Yikes. Not the land we wanted. Or the land we're going to take. I'll take the ship. The big fat ship. I'm taking the Niv Mizzet, unfortunately. Yeah, it seems pretty hard to cast. We have to have exactly three black and th or three blue and three red. Pure Recruiter can get Kiki Jiki, but not Splinter Twin. You can get Pestermite. You use what you. That's think what I meant. Mean. That's what I meant. <laughs> I just said a bunch oh, of nonsense, man. I would have took the hour for the sideboard. Really? Yeah, I mean it's probably pretty good in certain matchups, right? Really? Mm-hmm. Huh. Huh. I hate you. Do you? You at least one cut. Pure recruiter seems kinda meh. It does get a lot it gets most of our creatures though, to be honest. Yeah, but the only one we care for it to get really is Pestermite, right? The other ones are just kind of like whatever. It is a creature, though, and we do have a sword in our deck, so... Easy sword cut ever? I mean, we have two creatures that make sword, or like make sword tokens, so I don't think we're going to... I don't think it's that easy. What is Twin doing for you that you don't have any other parts? Uh, we have Pestermite. And also, like, also putting on an Inferno Titan or something like that is pretty good. Yeah. Um, I 
I had probably cut Rift Bolt before I cut Seagate Oracle. Yeah, I don't like cutting creatures here. Plus, Seagate Oracle is just useful. I can see cutting Compulsive. Uh, what about... The Pteromander just... I don't know. I feel like it's just going to be a... It's not. It's going to be big. Let's look at all the instants and sorceries we have. Ready? If Pteromander is not good because you don't have a lot of instants and sorceries, then Young Pyromancer and Murmuring Mystic are also not good. That's true, I guess. Alright, sure. I mean, it's, all, it's a good amount. I'm not sold on Imperial Recruiter, but maybe I should be. I don't know. I think it's the weakest creature we have. Oh, it for sure is. Yeah, let's just cut that. We can cut a control magic because we have treachery. I like having both. <laughs> so do I. We could cut the combo. Why, though? I don't know, man. Just cut the Imperial Recruiter. But then you won't work cut. 41? No, we can. I think we can play 16 lands. Really? With two 5 drops, two 6 drops? I don't know, man. We have a high curve. We have a lot of four drops. This is not a 16 land deck. We play 41. Okay. Done. Also, if we draw a pest, I don't know. Imperial Recruiter is kind of meh. I think Sword is great here, though. It makes all your 1 1 Dirtles do something. Some people don't like Swords, though. I, I understand. I get it. I'm just not Swords one of those also, guys. in this certain matchup, Swords are just so insane. He's right. Hey man, ask, let me ask you something. Okay. Who made who made the red man red? Pocahontas. Pocahontas made the red man red. It's a new hee hee video. There sure is, Michael. Let me tell you something, buddy. You can do whatever you like. Uh, I'll keep this. Turn to Runaway. Runaway steam can never come back. You ain't, you ain't never had a kin like me. Steam can like me. Also, what's nice about Pestermite is, like, this is a deck where sneaking through damage is super important. Yeah, Pestermite true. can just, can just tap something it can, randomly. It can just knock them out. Hey, we're playing against Blue-Red. I think our sword's going to be good here. This dude's dead. Oh. Well. How? Which way do we dead him? I think it's just Rift Bolt here. Just to tap it out? Yeah, that's good, actually. Just no reason not to. Tap it out. Tap, tap it out. Once one of those birds starts carrying a sword in its beak, you gotta watch out. That's true. Oh no. What you getting, boy? Probably something to kill our steam, can I imagine? What's that noise? That was your. F that you literally just made the noise. Before that. No, like, listen. You're talking about Hunter biting his little feet? No. I just kind of hum. Is it the fan? It is the fan. You didn't know the fan made that hum noise? No. You've been in here after like a million days. What, they get lightning bolt? Sure. You ain't never had a friend like me. Oh, they're just going to block? Okay. Whatever. I can't see what the mountain is behind Mike. What is that? <laughs> yeah, I was like, uh, it's a mountain. Imperial Recruiter. Okay. You got it. What you gonna get? What are you gonna get? I'll get a pester mite for my kiki jiki. Do we play our own pester mite here just to try to get aggro? No, because they have lightning bolt. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Well, we have a lightning bolt. <sighs> yeah, 
Yeah, do a little slurble. I did it. I did my little slurble. What's going to be? Mountain? That's that's unexciting. I'm not a fan. I think we just play this, but then they go lightning bolt this guy. Mm -hmm. They untap. They play Kiki Jiki. Mm -hmm. They copy this. They get their other target. Yeah, we still have a bolt to kill it, though. I guess that's true. They're not going to be able to kill us next turn. They're not going to have enough mana. Oh, for sure, but still, I don't like them just getting a free card out of it. Mm-hmm. Puts a lot of pressure on them, though. Oh, put a lot of pressure on them. Got him. Wow, they attacked us. They did not play anything. Fascinating. Are you going to kill this? Are you going to pester mite it? Wow, this could be amazing. Cryptic Command Bounce Draw. Okay. Now I have this this Aladdin song stuck in my head. I don't know why. You think it's because I've never had a friend like you? Maybe. Huh. Maybe. What if I stabbed you in those glasses? I don't know. I like they're just not playing the key. They're just like, no, I'll never play this. Oh, that's a good hit. And it seems pretty loose to play it into a bunch of mountains. It does, but what else are you going to do? You know what I mean? Eh, hey, what are you going to do, you know? This days is sneaky. I like it. It is. It's real sneaky, sneaky jeeky, if you will. Because <laughs> they could try to go like play guy. Play like Pestermite, untap a land, and then tap the remaining five to play the Magicum. Oh, they're just gonna do they're just gonna do one of these rallies. Okay. Do you remember that time you never had a friend like me? I do. Pepperidge Farm remembers. I'll play my Kiki Jiki. I'll copy my Imperial Recruiter. Oh, you're not going to do that. You got a free attacker out of it, my dude. End of turn? So you get a free blocker out of it? I don't understand. A Vencer, huh? You ever heard of the Shaper Savant? Do we play Islands? <laughs> yeah, it's right here. I mean, I'm tempted to just Pestermite untap the... Actually, we can Pestermite tap the Kiki Jiki next turn. But the problem is they have Venser, so like... Let's give them one turn to try to kill us. Shoot it too. Because now I have two two creatures on board that will kill you. Yeah. Saw a red spot on my hand. Thought it was blood. Was strawberry. Wow, that is what an emotional roller coaster that was. It was not blood. It was strawberry. Fortunately, I think if they have a. No, that's not going to do it. Don't care about that. If we had Exar here, we would be dead, but luckily they don't have it. 
Oh, we just memory lapse it. And then they vent her. The memory lapse. One, two, three. Oh, maybe they do. They can't then we do daze that. it. They can't do that now, though. Right. They're like, now they don't have enough mana. Is what but I they mean. didn't before. They would go three for DC Rex Arc, mm -hmm. and they have one, two, three, four for Venser, and then they're tapped out, so Daze counters either one of those things. You're right. My bad. How's the internet been today? It's been all right. No, no issues yet, but I do have some guys coming back tomorrow just to double check. Okay. All right. Are they going to loot here? Huh. Okay. Porque? Are they dead here? I think they're dead. They only have a Venser, which means they have to tap out to cast that Venser, and this guy doesn't do anything. And we have double counter spells. We won All the right. game. This is, I mean, Kiki Juki is just so fragile. Like, the Splinterman combo is so fragile. Negate seems good here. I agree. Sword's insane. Control magic seems meh. Yeah. Like they just have a bunch of mech creatures. Tragedy's probably not great either here. I don't hate stealing their Kiki Jiki. Is that a thing we can do? I say we take out Treachery board in Devil's Play. Okay. That's fine with me. Let's try to get them. What if they have like consecrated? What if they have like late game now? I'm gonna keep this in just because I think it's strong enough. Like if they have like consecrated Sphinx or Inferno Titan or like some kind of top end. Yeah, they could. Also, at worst, it's free. So. Right. Um. Yeah, this hand seems good. Oh, jealous. What happened? We have steam vents. <laughs> some guys have all the luck. And some guys have all the luck. You know that song? No. You don't know that song? What's nice about Mystics is it like survives all the red spells. Yeah, one five is big. That's a big beefy boy. What's up, Frank? Shoot him and toot him. I'm going to. I'm going to shoot him, and I'm going to toot him. Fortunately, this is the matchup where both of us just like who blinks first, right? <laughs> So we both just have the instant speed kill in our deck. Yeah, but unlike standard, it's you only get one. Oh, they missed the land drop. That's strong. No, they didn't. No. They just chose to play it post. Just like the main phase. Weird. <laughs> Interesting decision, I suppose. Time keeps on ticking, 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 ticking. I get that daze. I don't know about that dog. I'm not gonna sit here and do nothing. Like you could have waited a turn though. Cryptic command. Sure. So if we waited more one more turn, we'd have negate up. That was the thing. Oh, okay, Michael. I'm so sorry. He's right. Now we left the door open too. I got lightning bolt. There ain't no doors left open. Well, they, if they slam Consecrated Sphinx, they would be, like, super screwed. Well, what do we do? What if we do if they, like... If we had all our mana on tap, what would we do then? I, yeah, you're right. But like they, 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 they wouldn't go... They might not go for it then, though, you know what I mean? One oopsie doopsie. Well, they didn't kill us, so that makes me seem that they don't have the combo. Well, we had a, we had a red up, so I don't think they would have gone into it if we had a red up. Sure. I think we can. I don't want to take my red down, though. This is a charm it. What? This is a charm it. I feel like it's a charm it. I'd rather char it. Okay. How good is this guy for you? 
super good in this matchup. That's what I figured they would do, actually. They're bouncing their own deuter. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Gonna handle it. Are you ready? That's fine. Oh, they're bouncing the char. Interesting. Well, now I'm just going to wait till next turn and fire a confluence if we get a red as a red source. Let's draw a mountain. Here we go. Ugh, gross. Maybe we should just be playing that card. Maybe. Actually, not super sure how to deal with that. I mean, we can two for one ourselves to kill it. I think we have to, right? It's like a four for one. Yeah, but what else are we going to do? Just let it sit on the board and destroy us? I mean, it's going to do that anyway. Oh, God. I'm so disgusted by it. It's pretty bad. I mean, it's either that. Like, we either do this or concede. Like, those are our two options. Unfortunately, we cannot Thunderball and Char. Rip the band aid off, man. They go to six cards and they get to loot with whatever the frig they want twice. They get to look at the top five cards. Like, that seems insane. I feel like we're just already lost. Ugh, God, I'm vomiting. Maybe they misclick and kill their own looter? <laughs> no, they didn't. That'd be sweet. We take another two. Oh my god, I'm just feeling sick. Mm. Gross. Yeah, it doesn't feel good, but... Sure. Interesting. I guess you get another card. Oh, and then they loot again, so they get to shoot us again, sure. Any new cards stand out? Yeah, a bunch of them. A lot of them. Attempted to counter this, though. I don't think it's... No, because then they draw another card. Don't forget to play young. Well, I'm tempted not to because I want to keep up negate, but... They're not going to slam a negate threat, though. They're going to slam a... Theater. Yeah, I know. I yeah, but then yeah, I don't know, man. Look, we're just dead. It doesn't matter. Here we go. Here he is. <laughs> cool, same. <laughs> you like that? You like that noise I just made? I actually hate it. Okay, it was terrible. <laughs> it was terrible. I apologize. Oh, they got a spell seeker. You got Kika Jiggies in hand. I guess so. Give me a red card so I can play this stupid fiery confluence and then not. Please draw a mountain. That'd be great. Thank you. We did it, boys. Put them all in the garbage can. I hated that noise enough to meet it. Wow, that's amazing. There's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of hatred. If you guys haven't done so, definitely give me a follow or a subscribe on the old Twitch. Oh, Brown Town Stip, five veto picks allowed. Lands for fixing do not count as a veto. Also can be pushed back to a better queue if this is not strong enough format for the colorless draft. I don't think it is just because there's no metal workers and stuff. 
No, you can't do colors draft. There's not even signets in this one. I could definitely. Yeah. I'm gonna put it in my on my list though. No, oh, they had another thing. So I guess we're dead. Oh my god! See, I told you explosive. Yeah, this is what this is what it's good for. Well, we're not dead, but you're going to one though. One, two, three, four. I guess yeah, you just play it out. No, because they no, they just spell seeker and get a, a lightning bolt or some nonsense. No, they already spell seeker. No, they didn't. That's what they got with impure recruiter. Oh. Okay. What can we change? Can you imagine if we actually got this sword online, dude? We should just probably just be playing the Nimbus. I agree with you. So good if you land it. It's really good. What's bad here? Kind of like everything. I think control. Well, treachery. No, we've seen the. We've seen Niv. I think I want the control magic back in now that we've seen Niv. Niv? Yeah. Niv. Niv. God, they're so weird, aren't they? Do you want three six drops? They're all so good though. Hmm. It's kind of like a rift bolt. I guess we could cut a rift bolt. It's actually sorcery. It's sorcery so oh, I agree with all of that. Doesn't really help us. All right. K R T H L L one. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Yeah, I don't think mono brown's possible in this cube. K R L, thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. Uh, we'll cut the rift bolt. We'll cut the one drop for the six drop. Sounds good. Because even if you play Niv mm -hmm. it on turn like nine or ten, it's, it's still, still good. Like it, it, it pretty much won in that game. Yeah, they got a bowling net. This is oh, this is great. Keep. What are we ditching here? Oh, an island maybe. Assume we draw another one by four. Yeah, I don't really want to get rid of Treachery or Pestermite. Or Jace. Jace, yeah. Definitely not getting rid of Jace. Pretty sure if we land that guy with nothing on board, the game's just over. You ever cast a Jace before? It's pretty good. There's no feeling like it. Got me caught in a stranglehold, Jace. You got to to see. Straw land, Splinter Twin. Okay, well, we're halfway there. You got that land part right. Okay, challenge for one. Not bad. Do we just pester mite them on? Just like do it other upkeep, tap the red. Yeah, I like that because even if they kill it, we still get the land of Jace, which is pretty good. Yeah, it's probably worth it. And I'm not putting too much stock in just like winning with pester mite, so. Plus we have treachery, so we can technically randomly steal one of their pester mites to Tap it. Oh yes, sweet. They didn't do anything. Great. They had another red. Oh, butter my biscuits. This is where they kill us, right? They're like, oh, I'll just get you back. What up, mind stab throw? Oh, I don't know about that. What do you want to do? We have nothing You're else to open do. Open mana. They don't have two blue. Okay. The only counterspell we saw was Cryptic Command and... Counterspell? Yeah. Yeah, maybe it is right. And if they have Pestermite, we're dead anyway, right? So... Yeah, that's true. Now the question is, do we... Think about something. What if they tap out for a Kiki Jiki and then we can just steal it with the treachery? I feel like we're dead here. I don't like it. Yeah, but I don't know what they're thinking about. Like, you just... Okay. Are we plussing or are we drawing? I feel like we draw. Hmm. We know they have lightning bolts. Maybe you do go upstairs in case... Yeah, we don't want to lose it to lightning bolt, actually. That's a good point. Are you familiar with D&D &D at all? Had an oddness happen? Um, I... Not enough. Uh, put an island on the bottom? No. No, you can have the island. Here we go. Yeah, that's good. Well, it doesn't kill us, so. This is why we went upstairs. 
Unless they have another thing too, in which case. Burr, 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 burr. We also did not see Nimble Obstructionist in any of the games, so. Nope. Hmm. Five mana, huh? Oh, they just kill that? Fascinating. Interesting. So they just drew one. Well, that's, that is interesting. I kind of want to draw. I, I, I just want to treachery this guy. Yeah. Yeah, let's brainstorm. Thank you. Oh boy. Just put back mountain, mountain. Uh, I think island, mountain. Sure. Although if they have like, if they have an visit, I want to feel real bad about this. Yeah, but if we don't, they're where Jace is dead. Where Jace is dead. We could play. I mean, I'd rather lose Jace than than just have the Niv Mizzet on board, right? Like, if they resolve a Niv Mizzet, our Jace is probably dead anyway. That's true. Hmm. Wish we had one more land here. Just slam the Sphinx. Oh, for uh, sure. Wallet, welcome back, buddy. Thank you so much for the resub. I really appreciate it. You are awesome. We could play the. It might just be these two. Yeah, just play those two. At least some of you have a chump. <laughs> Game three. Good luck, by the way. A little late. Oh, man. Yeah, I think you just run those two out. Like, I don't know also, we'll, uh, what else would be better. At least this forces them to have two things. Yeah, if they have a removal spell anyway, Jace is probably just dead, right? So. Right. So we might as well develop our board. Plus, they do need an answer because it is a 3 1, so they do trade. And they had a bolt. Oh well. Uh, I mean, they just killed Jace, you know, and then we would have a nimble instructionist, but we don't really care about that. <laughs> How aggressive are we feeling? Have four cards still. Ugh. And we know they have cryptic gain counter spell. I think we can. We can wait, right? What? Not really, though. Like, do, giving though. them more time is feels worse. Yeah, that's true. I mean, I don't think it's going to resolve. Probably not. Never don't have it. Uh, cryptic. Oh, that's... That's significantly better. I'm much more inclined to have that. How you doing over here? You doing all right? Yeah. Okay, getting your life together? Okay. 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 A noble chicken. And that is one noble chicken. The noblest of chickens, you may say. That's are, we a, are we getting a trigger, boys? Looks like we oh. are. Triggers on the stack, boys. Triggers in my hand, boys. Okay. They have two cards. Okay. That doesn't kill us. They can bounce our thing though, which is pretty. No, annoying. they can't copy legendary creatures. Oh yeah, nice. Oh, I forgot about that. They probably did too. Yes. They're probably trying to do it right now. Yep, that doesn't work. Oh, that's sick. Okay, just copy your chicken. Sure. Oh, we can kill this, and then on their upkeep, we can actually uh, bolt the egg. Yeah, bolt the egg. Or we can kill the Kikijiki, that's also scary. <laughs> yeah. So we take four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, we can bolt the egg and the bird though. And we can steal the Kikijiki. This fire splits. Right? Oh, that's what we're doing. Yeah. Um wait, do we have to kill both of them? What does it say on it? I don't know, some nonsense. You can probably read it. Sacrifice this creature and return a card named Rekindling Phoenix. I think you repeat sacrifice this creature and return a card. So we have to kill them both. Yeah, that's... Or well, we have to kill the Kiki Jiki. That um, doesn't solve the problem. We're still in the Kiki Jiki. And then kill the two eggs. Or we let the egg resolve and we just shoot this. Because like now we can block the... Ch ah, we still have to shoot the two eggs, I think. Yeah, we're at six. I wish this was an Electrolyze instead. Uh, oh! 
Oof. That's good draws. Real good draws. Oh, yes, we are doing one it. one card in hand. And they didn't play anything, so we are doing it. Let's target ourselves. We can also... Oh, yes. Oof. Land. One, two, three. One, two, three. So we get to attack with this guy, which they literally can't deal with ever. We get to... Oh, we can't copy it anymore, though. I guess no, that's fine. That's fine. We just shoot the uh, three one. And we get to draw another card. Oh, yeah. Well... Yeah, this game is probably over. I mean, it could. I guess if they have randomly two different spells, we might die, but there's nothing we can do about that. Well, now there is. Mm -hmm. oh, they can go get expansion explosion, can't they? No, nope, because it's in the graveyard because they oh. killed our pestermite with it. Plus, they only have two damage with it right now, so it's not super exciting. Thankfully, they can't get fiery compulsion, whatever the friggin' card's called. Fiery confluence. That's what that's what we're talking about. ponder okay that's good because it's like it's it's saying hey man i don't really have anything here so i really need to dig rather than like lightning bolt or something so that's good because if they had lightning bolt in hand they would go get chain lightning and kill us but they also have lightning bolt in the graveyard which is yeah that's good to know six seven eight this is also lethal right we just attack with this we shoot them with this and we lightning bolt so they're dead on board four five six seven eight nine ten eleven yep that is lethal. Wow. Just got a faded turn here. Consecrated Sphinx is a hell of a drug. Did they choose the they drew a card of Ponder? I'm going to draw. Okay. Nope. No attacks. Okay. I'll also make a copy. Oh, never mind. Well, we can't. Well, we can oh, make yeah, a copy. We can make better. a copy of this guy, though. That's still fine. Wow, there's a lot of counter spells we have. This was a nail biter. It was. I don't think it is anymore. Also, don't chain lightning. Make sure you bolt. We don't want them to copy it and kill us randomly some silly way. Yeah. Pay your costs and I'll hit you. Tomorrow I'll miss you. Remember I memory lapsed. Our deck is real sweet. When it comes to Sphinx, I honestly don't think I've seen a card change the game this much in cube, whether Frank has it or is it... Yeah, I agree with you completely. If you get to draw two cards off of Consecrated Sphinx and you force them to have to deal with it, like, you usually... I think your odds of winning the game are extremely low. Or card extremely is, high, rather. Card is super nuts. In my butts. Is there anything we want? Do we want them to miss in the main deck? It's very good. It's so hard to cast, though. Is it, though? Whatever. I think our deck is good. I think that was actually probably... That almost felt like a bad matchup for us. So I think we're actually... I think that's good for us. No, we got away with a couple of plays there. Like, they just didn't have the counter spells when they should have. Right. I think they might have had the better deck. That's what I'm saying. I think we definitely keep this. I think this is fine. We can turn one Terry. Which may not seem that scary, but when he has when a he, sword... When, he, when, he, when that dude's carrying but weaponry... He, Terry might not be scary now, but when he carry... They'd but when scary. but when Terry carry he'd be real scary. <laughs> oh dear God! Also, Seagate Oracle holds a sword too. I don't know if you guys knew that. Oh, they're playing red. That's good. You can kill this. You can kill my Terramander. Yeah, it's not the end of the world if they do. Well, they didn't. So they just had nothing. That's great. This is nice and this is a nice slow game. What I like green the, red deck just goes nothing until turn three. Yeah, that's strange. That's weird. Me. What you got? They could be mono red. Yeah, that seems good. If they're mono red and we land a sword, then like Boy, let me tell you what. Give me a way to kill that guy. That would be nice. It's 
not a way to kill that guy. I don't know if you knew that. We could slam the sword and hope. I kind of like Seagate Oracle better because it just blocks. Yeah, that's true, actually. I didn't think of that. This will probably find us. Bingo. Yep. Next time we can sword and bolt. Now you can get in there? No, I'm going to try to double block. Like, because he's going to attack with all three guys, right? So. Don't care about that guy. Is this have, does he have the Tesseract? <laughs> it does look like it. I mean, if they attack with this guy and you just have to have to play this, I'm definitely double blocking your Legion War boss. And then we'll Lightning Bolt this guy. Yeah, this is fine. If you happen to have Lightning Bolt. Cool. bolt that guy for the sword and pass we could also splinter twin on the seagat oracle which is quite a bit of card advantage so much value that's right maze of it that's poor, annoying poor pedro mander never got his sword well never getting in with a sword uh, I have a Jace, though, so that's... Yeah, just sign the Jace. I think we tick up. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Because they have Raging Ravine. And red mana. Mm. <laughs> you got it. Put it on the bottom. No. Oh, well. So now they just attack with the Gobos. The Gobo Bros. Anyway, if we tried to Splinter Twin here, then we just, like, they would just char it, so. Alright, well, now we know. Why are they randomly playing Maze of it? That's so annoying. It's it's kind of funny, right? It's super random. I don't think it should be in their deck, but I get whatever. Maze of it is so actively bad against us, besides us randomly having a sword. Hmm. Yep, that's obnoxious. No, at least it's a good blocker against everything. Green. Everything against except green cards, I guess. <sighs> Draw memory lapse, play Carnage Tyrant. Super cool. I also wish I could Splinter Twin this now, but I can't. Right. <laughs> oh, man, the comedy is real, dude. Well, yeah, our deck just really can't deal with that. The cards in our hand are Memory Lapse, Splinter Twin, and Rift Bolt. This is really obnoxious. The card just super obnoxious. Like it's just the most uninteractive magic card of all time. It might be the most uninteractive magic card of all time. That might actually be true. Like I, I just think we're dead to that. I don't think there's anything we can do about it. I mean, we can draw like a Thunder My Hellkite and double block. And we could also just draw a lightning bolt and then kill it with rift bolt lightning bolt, right? What's the problem? Nope. <sighs> My goal is missing. I don't know if Hexproof's ever not going to be a thing. Wizard sure seems to like it. I hate it. Oh, good. Another guy that can't be countered. That wow, hurt. this is really ridiculous. Thankfully, that Jeez. guy gets blocked all day, but still. What can we draw here? That's. I don't know if there's anything we can draw. There's stuff we can draw. Infernal Titan would be good. Mountain is. Uh, 
Pretty close. Not going to do it. No? Hmm. I'm going to okay. take out the control magic. Um, do really? anything that kills a land? <laughs> Playing a red deck, any land destruction here? Nope. Lightning Greaves, actually not bad. For... Gets around Maze Myth. Sure. Gets around Char and stuff, too. I mean, I don't know. It's not terrible. I mean, if we're cutting the control magic, do we cut the treachery I don't know I like having one I don't like having two you know what I mean okay like treachery they're still playing a big fat dumb idiot green deck and we cut roof bolt sure I think the visit is There's something to block still with still good sure we have red sword we, are, we already have this red star I'm not gonna bring in two red swords unfortunately I don't like that nope I don't like it I think this is fine yeah pretty bad draws there too No, you can't unequip things unless you have something else to equip it to. Uh, yeah, this hand's great. Terry into Counterspell. Maybe that'll be enough. God, can you imagine how different that game would have went if they didn't have Maze of Ith? Like, on um, Maze of Ith, that, that game would have been over. Like, they just have, like, we just get to draw an extra card every turn, we get to deal them five every turn. Like, that's just not even a real game. How are you going to act? That's my little baby. Spiral of Canal. Well, that's basically a Spiral of Canal. I wonder if that was worth it. To save Terry? Mm -hmm. Please. I guess we have memory lapse, so it's probably worth it. Right. Like, I don't want to get stuck with a bunch of counter spells that can't do anything in my hand. Like, I, I like dazing like some of the first things I'm able to and also this guy if this guy does survive like it's just a very good threat with these two it only costs six to adapt I'll play um sure you think slowing down is slowing them down is the only thing we care about slowing Dama's reach all right lands we get it compulsive research sure I'll take the non-land card you got it. I mean, on turn four, we can bolt, and then on turn five, we can make a 5-5, five five, so it's actually not terrible. Let me guess, Kodama's Reach. One one blue, blue Exile target spell. Uh, I mean, we've seen that before, right? We've seen that... Um, oh, um, that's interesting, because the other two that do that are, are predicated on whether it counters the spell, right? Like, Dissipate, right? Like, that's counter target spell, Exile that spell, isn't it? dissipate yeah uh, i think so like you have to you still have to target it whereas mm -hmm. i actually don't hate that on here it forces them to deal with it right and then like we're just drawing extra cards every turn i'm gonna take the greaves here and maybe put it on there next turn This is not a terrible position to be in if they can't deal with this guy. If it's if their answer is like char, then they only get to play a three drop. Carnage Tower? Yeah, that's fine. We also get a blocker every turn if we want, so that's pretty cool. Pretty good blocker too. Say my name, say my name. Yeah, it means it means to take four turns instead of like. Also, seven damage in hand. That's not nothing. Just half their life total. And we get to draw an extra card every single turn. So like, I mean, this is it's not a, a little a weird little combo, but I actually kind of like it. Yeah, I mean, just being well, able to like, like draw an extra card, prevent three prevent damage. three damage. Yeah, that seems fine. And if they activate the raging ravine, we just bolt it, which is great. Probably char it because I think our mana is really valuable now that we have this guy. So the next turn we can bolt and then pay four for this guy. Oh, sure. Are they going to activate it? No. I can't. I just can't. 
Oh my god, so awkwardly. We have no, we have no answer to stupid maze of oaths. Well, Lenny Greaves. Oh yeah, I guess we can move it over to the Terry. So they're drawing a war boss. War box. That's rude. Man, it, it is what it is. Pretty good. So long, thready boy. Make a guy draw a card. Uh, compulsive seems good here. You can probably get rid of that. Oh, I'm going to char it. play that into that yeah that seems good all right well we know they're drawing legion war boss which we have infinite blockers for so i'm not super concerned with that all right so they have war boss and two other cards leading with war boss is a good sign uh i didn't want to poke them for one no i'd much rather I'd much rather prevent three damage from the the Carnage Tyrant than deal one damage. We don't win that race. Not in a million years. Unless you went with Murdering Mystic, in which case we knew they had Legion War Boss and we'd just rather block the the goblin token. God, this is real good. <sighs> That's funny. Still gonna take it. All right, well, we're at ten. One, two, three. We can move it over. Slam them for five. Move it over? Move over the lightning grease. Oh, because the maze. Mm -hmm. I got you. Hmm. Seems good, right? They have one card in hand. What are they going to have for five, five, and green, green, red? Whoa. You need to take. You need to get it together. Clearly, and then we just move the boots back after combat. God, what if they had, like char or something though? I'd almost rather just block this. Well, well, char doesn't do anything. It kills the secret oracle. So, you, what do you want to do instead? I kind of not want to do that, just because this is gonna. I think this is gonna win us the game. Whereas, like, we could double block with with like this and a bird. Okay. All right. Sure. Yeah, I think this is gonna win us the game. We're moving the Grievous so we can attack with Thunder Mile Hellkite. Yeah, we're not doing it because haste. We're doing it because Maze of Oath. Yeah, they just maze it. There's no reason to attack with it without the boots. We could also double block here because then it would have to choose one. And they're probably going to choose Hellkite. Can you try with the Oracle and the... Oh, that's right. Block him yeah. the Oracle. Never mind. The Oracle token, rather. Yeah, if you could chum block a Carnage Tyrant, it would be absolutely terrible. Does May 5th work on the Greaves? I don't know what that means. No, the Greaves doesn't work on May 5th. That's the one day a year where Lightning Greaves <laughs> does not give it Shroud. Is that a Maze of Ith joke? I get it. I see what you did there.
This actually seems like we're in good shape. They didn't attack. That's a good sign. We got him. We got him on the ropes, my dude. This guy also stays around till the next turn now. Uh, Inferno Titan. Ooh, I like that too. Yeah, it's just this guy for sure. We get to kill the shaman, so. Now we can attack with a Thunder Maw. Really? Why? Should have put one damage to their face. Oh, no, this is a 2 three. 3. Never mind. My bad. I'll put one to their face, and then they're like, all right, thanks for leaving my guy alive. You stupid idiot. You don't want to attack with a Thunder Maw now? I mean, I kind of do. Oh, I think they just, I think they just conceded. Yeah, okay. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Woo! It was a weird thing we set up, but it worked. Dude, it was it was amazing. The Greaves was killer, and the the Seagate Oracle drawing us a card and preventing three damage a turn is great. The problem is like we still didn't see many creatures for the Control Magic or the Treachery. I'm almost tempted to take the Treachery out too because you yeah, just like saw all they've nothing. shown us is Carnage Tyrant. That's it. But what are we bringing over Treachery though? I don't know. They've got to have like one of their stupid. They have to have one idiot. stupid idiot that we can take, right? Yeah. I feel like they've got at least one other. Why were you guys not using Greaves to avoid Maze? Because we didn't want to take off Splinter Twin and. Seagate Oracle because that's like a insane win condition so it literally won us the game so I don't really think it's worth I mean we're in no rush we win the long game because we're drawing every we single this? we're drawing a card every single turn so if they're holding like a lightning bolt or a char or something and this is the last card like I don't want to put, put my shields down just to deal five damage yeah it's not worth it that's a story that Seagate Oracle tells at the bar for the rest of his life <laughs> I was there. Play the island first. So you can you can uh, bluff the days. Okay. It's, nope. a, it's a small advantage, right? But, but it's still there. Something we can, yeah, yeah, nice. Oh, he did. All right, we we should draw now islands. Stop with the mountains. Yeah, we have this guy. Wish it worse can chump block a carnage T. No, look, they have maze. That's fine. They miss. They basically miss a land drop at this point, though. Yeah. Still though. All rampant growth. Kind of annoying. <laughs> oh, they have their own greaves. <laughs> My God, what is even happening, man? Island. Yes. Nicely done, man. You did that. When they have three mana, I don't think we're terribly scared of it, so I'm just going to slam Seagate Oracle here. Yeah, let's take the Jace. Oh, I'm going to take that guy. All right, so our hand is looking very, very good right now. We take out the Treachery for game four, right? Yeah, now we do because of the Greaves. Boy, remember that time we were like, they only saw two creatures with, with Hexproof. Now we now, now they all, all have the creatures, it. Yeah. Okay, they missed, they missed nice. another land drop, so they basically That's missed great. two land drops. Yeah, we just fade till now. This is this is game. I can guarantee you this is game. Uh Niv Mizzet in any match you can cast him is pretty impressive. The only thing wrong with this card is the casting cost, and if you can get around that, it's unbelievable. Anything that costs three or more, you are I'm keeping it on the top. Oh no, do they have incinerate? Oh, it doesn't matter because we oh. Alright. Okay. Interesting choice. Primeval Titan, put him on the bottom. No, that's you can have that one. That's all yours, my dude. Buddy, I got a memory lapse in the treachery. That Primeval Titan is gonna stay right where he is. It feels good. I'm just gonna keep fate sealing. Yep. Uh, put it on the bottom. Yeah, that's fine. No land for you. Okay. I mean, they could have two in a row. You can also tap whatever they threaten Jace with here. Oh, no, they had two in a row. Hmm. Oh, well. That primetime could win the, win the game if they could actually get cast. Yeah, that's, I mean, that's every primeval titan, though, right? I. No, I'm just going to steal this, untap all my lands, and then fate seal them again. Because then we can cast Niv Mizzet with this guy. I like it. Oh no, they got they got lightning greaves though. You char it. Try what? Char their guy. Yeah, that's fine. God, treachery is terrible now. 
Mm -hmm. Wow, I just realized that we're never going to actually resolve a treachery. This is terrible, dude. Oh, man. Splinter one? That would be good. Still pretty good. Now, they drew a land, so now do we start brainstorming? Yeah, I want to brainstorm because I want to hit a land so I can Inferno Titan here. Yep, that is fine. I'll put the treachery back, and I'll put the compulsive research back. Because I mean, even if they even if they send this dude home, like they're still taking three a turn. Yeah. So it's still it still at least nugs them. Plus, we do have our li own lightning greaves somewhere in the deck. Plus, now Jace is really high, so like, you know, he likes to smoke that ish. So now he can. Who are you talking about smoking the ish? <laughs> What are you saying right now? I don't know. I was going for a joke. It didn't work out. Who smoke? Who is it? Who's smoking the ish? Jose and Jace was because you know he's so high. It sounded like you said Jose and Jace. <laughs> hey, they're smoking the ish. That's Jose and Jace. Okay, well that's good. Man, this primeval titan is gonna get countered. Yeah, it's gonna take him a while too. And then we can fate seal it. It's basically that's a, oh I didn't even think of that. That's really good. Yeah, you just put whatever you don't like on top, and then you just send it back. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we have an extra turn here. It's impulsive first. What if we mem what if we pester might and tap this down? That deals him nine? No, it deals, well, it deals him eleven if we actually If we pumps. You want a compulsive first? I just don't care about the three. Also, if we'd land a Niv Mizzet, compulsive and Jace this is six damage. Because we draw six oh, cards. Yeah. Let's brainstorm. Yeah, we're brainstorming. I want to hit an island here. And then I don't care about your primeval titan. Uh, oh, uh, mm. oh, mm, mm, mm. uh, we're putting you back and then you back. We're going to play you. Yeah, we're going to attack for a million here. They're going to send him home, but they're going to take three in the process. Next turn, they're going to primeval titan. We're going to bounce it. And then we're going to uh, pester might splinter twin when they're tapped out. Didn't I just? I just said we can pester might the, the maze of it. Come on, beers, get it together. Yeah, they're just probably dead here. So I actually want them to hit a six land so they can. Tap yeah. out and die. We have an infernal titan and a Jason seven. Tap out and die. Oh, they're gonna take two. I wrote that before you said it. Yeah, a likely story. A likely story. Here you go, you ready? I would concede right here if I were them. I mean, the realistically, we can also Pester might tap this down. And then we can Splinter Twin so that we just have the overkill. Let's do that. Okay. Because then it's 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and then we can pump it for whatever. Uh, would you like to tap it? I would love to. Yeah, it's like 14 damage. We don't need to splinter twin here. There's no reason to. Yes, we do. <laughs> They're dead a million ways. Huzzah! <laughs> Our deck is pretty sweet. I'm going to play it again. Yes, I'm being bullied. <laughs> you can check the VOD, my dude. How dare you? How dare you challenge me? Yeah, get those glasses on. Look at your phone through those glasses. It's a little awkward. That's what I say about you. What do you think about Mike? It's a little awkward. Wow. You know what you did. Look at your... Yeah, now look at your glasses through your phone. I'll play first. I'll keep this hand. We got a lot of expensive stuff. We also got a nice little curve here. We got a two, a three, a three, a five, and a six. What did you say to me? I'll send you to the clink, buddy. Wow. The clink, huh? 
I'll send you to the Colonel Clink. The Colonel Clink. My body tensed up when I was... <laughs> As did all of our bodies. So say us all. I'm just going to get in there for one. Because it's a 1-1. One, one. Oh my god, beers. Oh, they, they just didn't play anything. I like when they do nothing. That's, that's cool. my that's my favorite thing about magic. I'm just like, what are you going to do? Nothing? Okay, sounds good. I don't want you to be forced to kill this 1-1 one, one with a removal spell. I really don't want you to do that. What happens now, you think? Kalidus? Big Chupa Loops. Hmm. Should we just pester mine here in case we draw Splinter Twin? You could. They put the clock on them, too. It's not a great clock, but, you know. Sometimes, what if they just concede? They're just like, oh, dang, I'm dead. Come on. Oh, dang, it. dang it. I mean, this is still pretty good, right? Yeah, this is still seven damage seems all right. And we have four in hand, so they're basically dead next turn, actually, if they can't answer these. I mean, I'm black, though, so. Yeah, I imagine probably they have can. at least one rule spell. Here comes, heart, here comes full mana lightning helix, or murderous, murderous cut. Mm. Solid. But my Pestermite gets to live again. If we hit a land or a Splinter Twin, we're in good shape. That's the literally the worst land you could hit. I still like it, though. I don't, because it lets us do nothing this turn. But next turn, huh? Yeah, but I'd rather this turn, because then we get to draw two. I'm playing mono black. What are we scared of? Their creatures? If you have like a he on mouth here, that'd be pretty annoying. Would it? Yeah, just take it though. Yeah, I'll just steal that thing. Get together, try to love Michael B. right now. Conti. Mm. That's annoying. Mm. I don't like it. Two punch man. Is that just worse than one punch man? That's one whole extra punch. Ooh, that's good. I think this is better. worse if they have a removal spell. I don't like it enough to treachery it unless we could have also gotten the card from it. Yeah, I would definitely save treachery or something else. Yeah, they have it. Of course they do. Lucky, 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 lucky. I mean... I have not seen One Punch Man. I've seen one episode of One Punch Man. What is this? Jesus... We're just gonna make a zombo? Okay. He haw mouth in the graveyard. Time to just steal something. One, two, three, four, five, we steal something. One, two, three, four, five, we can steal zombie and then sword them. The problem is they're gonna get oh, that back. Oh, this is terrifying. Yeah, they're gonna get that back, so we need to play around that. Can we kill them on that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, we actually, let's do that. We can also draw like lightning bolt or chain lightning and just murder them. That's not it. But yeah, but we just had the untap and also this guy doesn't die to mask worm, so that's just fine. Super relevant. A super relevant, dude. Yep, you got it. Mm -hmm. I don't have a 2 1. Yikes. Well, I guess we're dead. Lucky, 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 lucky. Oof, too many pips. No? No one will show me? Okay. <sighs> Still want this on the main deck. Of 
Can't get yeah control magic. Hmm. Seems like it really. Yeah. Uh, we could put Greaves in. I don't mind negate. Yeah, they have plenty of mono the things to negate. Cut a rift bolt char. Eh, rift bolt's fine too, I guess. I think char is a little better just because it's instant. Just because it's instant, I think char is a little bit better. I think I like it because it's an instant speed removal spell, and you can cast it whenever you <laughs> like. You can cast it whenever you like. Snap keep. Of course, this is the uh, the ultimately bad mask worm hand. It's like all our hands. Well, specifically this one because we have a one one a two one that makes one one. So if they have mask worm, it's no boy now, my dude. But if they don't, uh, I guess you're right. I didn't even think about that. Chase is also very good against them. They do have Raskus Contempt, though, so got to watch out for that one. Don't tell me what to watch out for. I mean, you can't really watch out for it. You just kind of hope they don't have it. Uh, let's discard a land, island. I feel like we're actually doing okay here. Next time we get to Fiery Confluence, make a dude or Jace. Of course, this is where they just go, like, Liliana of Last Hope, kill our young Pyromancer. Nighthawk? Sure. That is killable. I mean, we could also just Thunder My Hellkite. No, not Thunder My Hellkite. Uh, we could Jace bounce it. Swing. I actually like that. So we have 10 damage in hand. That's actually insane, right? That's a good amount. Sure. Damage is done, my dude. Probably brainstorm. Yeah, I want to hit a land. And we did. We can put you back. You can tap their... I'm going to steal this. I'm going to put Confluence on top. Sure. One, two, three, four, five. Seems pretty good. We go to five, and then we have literally Fiery Confluence on top. Kills them. Cool, <laughs> Ashmanel. Thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back, buddy. Six months. Even if I wasn't in, or, even if I wasn't in all of the content, also did you receive my email about the commander inquiry? Yes, I did actually. Uh, it is starred, and I have to respond to it. Um, yes, yes, I did. Um, what was I going to say? Also, if you guys are interested in a service that lets you subscribe to digital magic cards, uh, magic online cards, or physical cards, you can borrow actual decks for like events like Grand Prix or Grand Prix Trials or whatever you guys are going to. Definitely check out manatraders.com. They offer lots of different subscription models. And with promo the promo code and the link in my description below, you can get 20% off the first three months, which is a really sweet deal. So definitely check that out if that's something you're in the market for. You can also check out meundies.com slash Frank Lepore. You'll get 15% off along with free shipping and free returns. Those are just a couple of ways you can support the stream. You know what? I'll keep this and I'll, you know, with our scry, we'll, we'll be sure to get another land, so. Oh, oh wait. wait. Wow. Okay, that was weird. Okay, that was weird. What are we, uh, what are we shipping here, though? That's the question. Shipping? Yeah, what are we shipping and shipping, my dude? Probably that four drop. Why not the five drop? Because he's smashy. He does smashy. My God. I think it is. I have a pair of MeUndies. They are very comfy. I agree with you. They send me a bunch of free samples, and they are fantastic. <sighs> blue. Okay, you're not a blue, but... So we're just going to die because we can't throw blue mana. I get it. I understand. Sounds about par for the course. Dark Ritual. Okay. Hmm. 
It's not seeing that. I mean, maybe he's light on lands. Hmm. Interesting choice, though. Hmm. 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 Does that also make the underwear real? What does that mean? Does Manny ship outside the U.S.? I don't know, actually. That I do not know, unfortunately. Well, you can't actually twin Gonti because Gonti is a legend. No, you can split your twin, I guess. You can't Kikijiki him. Do we just hope? Do we just do we just cross our fingers again? Um. Or just see get Oracle? We'll just like see getting. I'm just gonna take the island here. Do you mean you want to keep playing the game? I do. <laughs> Oh, I see what you did there, Moochel. Oh, boy. What a revolting development. Oh. Oh, they didn't have a land drop. They are light on land. Holy yeah, ba holy that. bajolies. So what do we do here? I think we just sword and try to get the sword online next turn. Sure. Okay. I like that. Because then, if they if they go to kill this, we can it charm. Yeah. The removal spell. That seems real good. Oh, they're just going to kill it now instead. I see. Yeah. Okay, well, that's fine, because we have a Thundermont Hellkite and a Pestermite that we'd much rather be surviving. Hmm. You can do whatever you like. They drew a land. They're so lucky. Oof. That's a char that's charable, man. I don't care about that. You have to charge, though. It's going to beat us to death. Or we could... No, oh, never mind. What? So we could Pestermite it. It's true. And chart later. Really wish we had a land drop here, I'll be honest. Yeah, that would have been real good. We could Pestermite untap, put a equip. Yeah, but they're playing black, so it doesn't really matter too much. You can keep it in the gate then. Does that. Wait, how? Because we untap one of our lands. I don't care about tapping this. Like, we'll go to 10. That's not a big deal. It is when they have. They have Gary, remember? That's. I still don't think they're. They have three mana. Like. Okay. We didn't actually have to do this on our on our turn, I guess. No, but we did, so whatevs. Mm -hmm. He did hit a land. Probably have Chupacabra, because they always do. For that. That's pretty good. Yep. Now we should with the sword on there. Yeah, that was probably that was really bad. Now I feel stupid. Go to nine. Yep, that's what that probably cost us the game there, unfortunately. Plus not drawing land. All right, we kill this. We take one, two, three, four, five, six. So we go to three. Yeah, that's insane. Yep. Not so much two land drops. I mean, I was crucial. I was preparing for like a regular removal spell, like a murderous cut or Vraska's contempt. I didn't think they had murderous red cap. Otherwise, I would have just equipped it. <laughs> okay. Still draw land. Good to nice. know. Like if we hit a land, we could at least ice something. But yeah, now we're just dead. Yep. Anyway, we could run. Good run. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe and check me out on Twitch and Patreon. Links are in the description below. If you guys don't have the money to subscribe on uh, Twitch, which is a huge help as a, as a full-time streamer, you can definitely check out Patreon. And even a dollar a month is super helpful. And it's like, that's basically the lowest you could ever. That's basically the lowest you could ever get. But thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. You guys have been awesome. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. I'll see you next time.